Welcome. Thank you for being here. My name is Alex. Subscribe and we'll start your daily yoga practice today. This is a 20 minute full body stretch. We'll move, we'll build a little bit of strength. All levels are welcome. No props are needed. Let's begin in a child's pose. The big toes together, knees apart. Walk your hands forward and away from you. And on an exhale, soften down to the mat. Bring your awareness to the present moment. Bring awareness to the quality of each breath. in and out through the nose, exclusively as best as you can. Arrive. Press up to a tabletop. Tuck your toes and let's draw some circles with the torso to the right, forward, left and around almost going to an up dog and back to child's pose. Let's go both directions. Roll out one wrist at a time, just feeling out from head to toe, everything you can feel right now. All right, neutral spine, knees hip width, hands shoulder width, tops of the feet are down. One round of cat cow. On an inhale, arch the back and look straight ahead. Exhale round and tuck your tailbone. Neutral spine. Tuck your toes, hover the knees and press back to a downward facing dog. Pedal this out, bend one knee at a time as you press the opposite heel down. Roll out one wrist at a time if balance is okay. Let's take a couple of breaths in stillness. Open up through the triceps, press through the front part of your hands. Let the head and the neck relax. baby steps to the top of the mat. Separate your feet about hip width and bend one knee at a time, both knees at a time. Ragdoll. Try to get the entire back body engaged. Or opening, I mean. All right, bring the feet together. Soft bend in the knees as you relax over the legs. Press to stand. Bring your palms to touch. Stand up tall and reconnect to the present moment. On an inhale, arms reach wide and overhead. Palms face each other. Keep your arms shoulder width and you're going to be bringing the biceps back by the ears. You'll feel a little bit of a pressure in the shoulders, try to not arch your lower back. Inhale, look up, reach up. Long exhale, forward fold, soften the knees. Hands to the mat, right foot back to a lunge. Always, every time, feel that stretch in the back foot, engage the back leg, front knee is over the ankle. Lower the right knee, leave the toes tucked, look straight ahead. Long exhale, try to press the leg straight, press through the back heel. Two more just like that. 
Inhale to open up the hip flexor, shoulders down. Exhale, press the legs almost straight or straight. Pyramid pose. Once more. Lower the knee, open up the heart. Exhale, pyramid pose. Lunge, lunge twist, right hand down. Left arm opens, fingers spread wide, reach up, stay low. Left hand down, step to the top of the mat, Relax over both legs and scan your body right to left to feel what's changing. Round up to standing. Arms overhead. Inhale, look up, reach up. Swan dive forward over soft knees. Left foot back, lunge. Feel the back leg stretching, the back foot stretching. Shoulders away from the ears. Draw in the core slightly as we begin to open up the hips. Even more, lower the left knee, look straight ahead. Long exhale, do your best to press both legs straight. Two more, breathe in. Open the left hip flexors. And exhale. Straighten the legs almost or all the way. Once more. Long exhale. Lunge. Lunge twist. Left hand down, right arm opens. Right hand down, forward fold at the top of your mat. Allow yourself to find a little more space in the entire back body. Round up to standing. Inhale, arms reach wide and overhead. Look up, reach up. Swan dive forward. Halfway lift, long flat back. And from this look up position, hands down, feet step back into a plank pose. Press the mat away, really feel lifted. Pull in the core. Smooth out the breath. Lower to your knees to the mat if you need to. We're going to chaturanga down halfway, elbows in close. Upward facing dog. Press the hands down, shoulders away from the ears. Tops of the feet are down. Someday the knees lift off of the mat. Let's linger here for a moment, opening the front part of the body. One more inhale. Exhale, tuck your toes, downward dog. Inhale, lift onto your toes. Exhale, press the heels down, press into the palms. Lower your knees to the mat. Press back into a child's pose, but prop up onto your elbows. So knees are about just a comfortable distance apart be on your elbows, walk them away a little bit, keep your hips back, touch each shoulder, and relax your forehead down. Feel this in your triceps. And recognize that we've been in child's pose before, but you have shifted your perspective in just a few moments of time. Release your hands. Press up to a tabletop. 
And let's go all the way onto our stomachs. Rest your forehead on the left hand and bring the right foot in for a quad stretch. Press your hips, your pelvis forward and down. Switch. Bring the left foot in to stretch out the quad. And I have either, you can have your hand flat or a fist for your forehead pillow. Release. Press up to a strong tabletop and sit back. Bring your feet out and around in front of you. Soles of the feet together, knees are apart. Hold on to the outsides of the feet, shoulders down and away from the ears. Fold over your butterfly legs. Scan the body for tension. Not necessarily in the hips. Notice if you're clenching your fists, maybe a thought. sit up. Leave your left leg where it is. Extend the right leg out in front of you. Square to the right leg. So the foot faces away from you. Inhale, reach up and fold over the right leg. Smooth out the breath as you stretch the hamstrings. And you might feel this in your back as well. Sit up, switch legs, left leg out, right foot in, let the knee open up to the side. Do your best to lengthen the spine and fold forward. Release, reverse, tabletop. Feet are on the mat, about hip width distance. Bring your hands behind you, fingertips point toward the heels. We're gonna press and lift. And if it is okay with your head and neck, you can let the head open back. Breathe. And. Sit down, extend your legs out in front of you. Both arms reach up and fold forward over both legs. Sit up. Turn to face the long edge of the mat. Left foot in, right foot out. Oh, that feels good on the inner thighs. All right, shoulders back and down and reach up and over with your left arm for a side body stretch. And you'll also feel this in the hamstring and the right leg. Sit up and switch sides, right foot in. Left foot out. Give yourself a moment to adjust and make sure you're even between the sit bones. Right arm up and over. Try not to dip forward. We want this in the side body. And sit up. Make your way back to a tabletop position. Tuck the toes, downward facing dog. Stand on your left foot and lift the right leg back and up. Let the hip open, squeeze the right glute, strong lifted leg. 
pigeon right side. Right knee behind the right wrist. Do your best to square your hips to the top of the mat. Shoulders back and down as best as you can. And relax over the right leg. Take your time. We're here for a few breaths. Just do your best to keep your thoughts present. Think about this inhale. And this exhale. Start to release, press into the hands, and we're going back to downward facing dog. Lift the right leg back and up once more for a reach. Two feet. Lift onto your toes, tuck the chin, and ripple through to an upward facing dog. Leave the toes tucked, the knees down, lift the chin at the end. And back to downward dog, arch the back, tuck the chin at the end, and then relax the head and the neck. Stand on your right foot, the left leg lifts. Open the hip, press a little extra into the left hand to keep the shoulders level. Pigeon, left side. Take your time, stay present, and soften forward. This breath in, that pause in between, and this exhale. Start to release out back to a three-legged dog with your left leg back and up. Downward facing dog. Once more ripple through upward dog. Untuck the toes, come back to a child's pose. Bring your awareness to the breath, to the present moment. Make your way to a comfortable seated position. And we will close with a breath. On an inhale, arms reach wide and overhead. Exhale, lower your hands down. Thank yourself for your practice. I am so grateful for your presence. 
Thank you. Namaste. So feel free to check out some of the links in the description box below. There are some of my favorite things, products. There's a mini trampoline you should probably check out. And that's all I got for you. Namaste.